You're watching Lestrade Games on Twitch.tv, YouTube.com, or Periscope.tv. Tonight, we are finally doing Forgettable Tale. I know I missed it on Friday, but we're doing it today. If this is your first time tuning in, be sure to hit that follow button, hit that subscribe button, and if you're feeling extra, extra spicy, check out my Patreon and the link in the description. And with that, let's get right into the questing. We are live! With the optimal quest order. Um, so first order of business. I know I missed the stream on Friday, and it was for good reason, but I missed it. So I'm very sorry about that. So now we're doing Forgettable Tale today. And uh, I hope you enjoy it. And I hope you enjoy the changes that I made to my microphone. Um, I don't know if you can notice the difference. You'll have to go back and watch the other episodes uh, to perhaps notice them. But I did some tweaking uh, over the couple days. Um, changed kind of, it kind of has more of a podcast sound now, I would say. So hopefully you enjoy that. If it sounds like complete garbage, let me know. And um, I'll fix that, I guess. Um, but to me, it sounds a lot better and there's not as much uh, background noise. I, I, I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'm fooling myself. Uh, second order of business. A new RuneScape news episode has just been posted on my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash C slash Lestrade Games. Go over there after the stream and check it out. Um, change the format based on some feedback I got. Hopefully you like it. If not, I'll change it again. It's only on episode three. It's It's designed to to change and evolve and be you know whatever the community wants it and needs it to be so not set in any ways any shape or form on that so um runescape news episode three quality of life mini games so check it out after the stream um now let's start with first of all we got to get we got to get the questing outfit on um do i need to fight anything in this i don't so we're gonna get we're gonna wear our light clothes questing outfit because we don't want to be want to be bogged down with the weight or anything so we'll do that let's get the whip out we gotta at least have some weapons in our hand I mean you know can't uh... okay that doesn't change anything so I'm gonna leave that what about this? Is this oh no wait I can't just take stuff out and expect to change the weight what am I doing uh, anyway so so let's see what if we already have some stuff. We already have the 400 coins. I don't we have I don't have the barley malt. I got some buckets. So two buckets. Um, I have a spade. Do I have a seed dipper? I don't. We'll have to go and buy that. Uh, do I have a rake? I don't have a rake. I do have a pot. Pots I got. Uh, do I have a ke kebab? Do have kebabs. Um, three beers. I do have three beers. Uh, dwarven stout I can get during the quest. 
the beer glass, I have three of those. Uh, fermenting vat, the one import faz mats doesn't work. You have to do use the one in Keldegram. Random item off the list below, so we'll have to wait for that. Uh, games necklace. Check. I'll. You know what? I'm gonna buy a new one. Um. Access to Gnome Glider Network. I do have that. An enchanted Slayer Ring to teleport near Keldegrim. I don't have that, but that's that's okay. Um, let's go over and get a Games Necklace and a Ring of Dueling. And as always, I forgot to turn on the game sounds, which I know everybody, everybody enjoys the game sounds. So we will turn them back on because that's the only way to do the optimal quest order is with the optimal music for RuneScape. And that is the original RuneScape music. None of that other junk that some people will put on there so let's see we need games necklace games necklace i need money in my monies okay ooh more monies more monies making all that monies okay games games necklace boop, 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 boop. and ring of dueling boop, 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 boop. boom got it Boom. Got it. Okay. Now we need to. F no! <laughs> Why did I do that? Come on. God damn it. Okay. Buckets. Two of these. Beer. Three of those. A pot, one of those, a spade, one of those, a kebab, let's grab two of those just in case I misclick something, uh, okay, and actually I need to get a few other items from the Grand Exchange here, and Dwarven Stout. Get one of these. We also need a seed. Dip. Seed dipper. Boom. Seed dipper got. We also need a rake. Rake. No, rake. Rake, rake, rake. Got it. Got the rake. Okay. What else? What else? What else? Spades got. Seed dipper got. Rake got. Pot got. Kebab got. Three beers got. Drovers out got. Beer glass will get. I got. Got that. Two barley malts. try this barley malt let's do 2k each boom okay no why did that uh... oh, okay and place those there to kill the gram
bring it. I didn't bring the necklace or the thing. Oh, well, there's a bank here, so no big deal. No big deal. No big deal. There, there, there are ways. There are banks. Okay, we need to... I had to call the gram. A great way to get there is using the metagame group finder teleport to blast furnace. Another way, a great way to get the card trap door. Blah, blah, blah. To start the quest, talk, talk to... Veldabon, commander of the Black Guard in the Black Guard HQ, West Caldegram Bank. But we need to cross the bridge. And look, hey, there's the blast furnace. Which uh, had some new poll questions, so check out that. Alright, so we're gonna come over here. This way, I'm gonna go to the bank. Gonna click on the search and get that stupid game's necklace and get that stupid ring of dueling. Oh. We're gonna talk to Veldabon. There he is. Oh, please, please, plocks must open door. Oi, Lestrade, have you heard? You mean half the world was, su has suddenly become a th farmer? No, not that. It's the Red Axe. What have those grumpy little guys done now? They've left the city! They were already boycotting the trade floor, but now they've completely left the city. Oh dear, is that serious? It's never happened before! At the moment, it's unclear yet if they've left the consortium as well. The directors are in turmoil! So what happens now? Well... I may require your services again. Are you interested in hearing more? Very interested. We need some more information about what the Red Axe is up to. Are you asking me to spy on them? Isn't that treason? The other directors of the consortium don't think so, and are likely to expel the Red Axe completely anyway. So, where would you like me to- where would you like me to go? That's the problem. We don't know where they've moved their headquarters to, but we may have one lead. Yes? There's a dwarf all the way to the northeast in Keldegrim East. He talks about kebabs a lot. Don't suppose you've met him? Do I say yes? Yes, I do believe I have. Smashed glasses, wrecked house, poor personal hygiene standards, brother or cousin to that other drunken dwarf. That's him, poor fella. He didn't always used to be like that. But he seems to know something about the Red Axe for some old reason. He speaks of them sometimes and... One of his many rants. Problem is, no one believes him. Everyone thinks he's completely mad. But perhaps... And perhaps they're right. But, if he does indeed know something about the Red Axe, or where the headquarters may be, we need to find out. What do you say, Lestrade? Do you want to help the Black Guard with this? 
Sounds like just a job for me. All right then. Whoop. We shall. Excellent. Good luck to you in your quest. May Guthix protect you. Man, what's going to happen? Rise of the Red Axe, part two. Forgettable tale of the drunken dwarf. Well, here I am at the Drunken Dwarf's relative's residence, who is also drunken. I wonder what drunken tales he can tell me. Oh, I don't have the coins. Nah. Huh. Okay, anyway. Hello there, are you alright? Of course! Why? Why? <laughs> Why shouldn't I be? Hey, you look vaguely familiar. Haven't I seen you somewhere before? That's not likely. I've been here for... I've been here for years. I've been looking after this house for my my cousin. Or was it my brother? A family member anyway. And where is this family member of yours? All over, all over East. He went off to wander all of RuneScape. Don't remember why. Hmm, I wonder. I may have met him. He's coming back sometimes. Says he needs more kebabs. Or is it just a dream? Sometimes I dream about kebabs. Invade Keldigashim something. When you eat them, they take over your mind, they do. An army of mindless kebab eating dwarves. Yes, well, I, I think I should be off now. The kebabs will come for you! Well, he didn't give us any information. Let's try. Let's try. I need to know about the red axe. The red axe will come for you. What? What do you mean? I don't know. I c c can't think straight when I'm sober. You don't look very sober to me. Don't contradict me. Or I won't tell you about it. About it. Whatever it was you wanted to know. Have you ever considered to stop drinking? It's bad for you. I'll stop right after you give me some of the good stuff. Speak to the dwarf who's rather drunk and will ask you for a drink. Talk to him and give him a beer. Beer can be bought. Okay.
Yes, here you go. What was that? No, no, no. This is no good. I want some of the really good stuff. What's the really good stuff? Some of them original kill the stout. Ash blue, ash the river, ash strong ash, old Duncan's rock, ash foul tasting ash ash. Hey, I don't think that's good for you. I know, but give me some of it anyway, and I'll have a I have a seed. I know, but give me sh some. What am I supposed to do with a seed? You silly human, silly, silly, silly <laughs> human. You need four seeds and grow them into hops. <clears throat> hops, hop, hops. <laughs> Where do I, where do I get the other seeds then? Some of me drinking buddies might have them. They're quite rare, you see. Oh yes, quite rare. Drinking buddies. Right, I think what you're trying to say is I need to find some other drunken dwarves, collect Kelda seeds from them until I have four, then grow them into hops so I can make Kelda stout. You're awfully smart for a human. Maybe that's just because I don't drink as much as you. You need to drink, you need to grow some Kelda hops. I have one seed, I need four. The Dragon Dwarfs gives you the first seed. The next seed, go west side and talk to Gauss. Gauss? He is in the King's Axe Inn, south of the bank, and he will ask you to do a toast with him. Buy a beer, touch him again to get the seed. Okay, that's fine. Uh, because I think I am. Yep, just need to cross the bridge. Wait, which way do I go? Toward the kebabs. Okay. Toward the kebabs. Okay. Now you can get the 400 coins. Okay, so we need 400 coins. And we need to go here. Goss! A good day to you, sir. And to you. Say, you know a lot about beer, right? Aye, a fair bit. If I say so myself, yes? What do you want to know? Do you know anything about Keldestal? Ah, a very rare that is. Very rare indeed. This place doesn't stock it. Don't think of the laughing miner does either. Yes, that's what I heard. So I'm going to brew it myself. Then y'all probably need some seeds. Have you got any? Have a toast to our good health with me and I'll tell you drinking is bad for you but i'll make an exception this time hurrah for the human cheers cheers
That was fun. Here, I have got a calder seed left. A sociable chap like you is more than welcome to it. Whoa, I already got two seeds. For the next seed, go to the Laughing Miner pub, east side Keldegrim, and you should see uh, the Rowdy Dwarf circling the pub. If you don't see him, walk counterclockwise around the pub. He asks you for a random item in exchange for another seed. Oh boy. That's- this is the one- oh! Ho! Oh, I already got another- I got, already got one of these today, and now I'm getting another one. I'm so excited. Two genies in one day? Uh, uh, thank you. And put that right into the strength. That's right, we have 85, almost 86 strength. Going for that 99. Uh, yeah, and we're using the nightmare zone. Get over it. Anyway. <laughs> we need to go over to the, uh, laughing minor pub. And we'll get that, we'll get that next seed. We'll get that next seed, man. Who are you? There he is. Hold on a second there. I need your help. Help from me. You must be more drunk than I am. No, I try not to get drunk. It's not good for you, but I do need help in brewing some beer. Mmm, beer. I need to brew Keldestal, but I haven't got enough seeds to grow the hops. Mmm, Keldestal. Do you know where I can find any seeds? Um, I, uh, yes, I just might have a seed like that. But you're not going to give it to me, are you? No. Alright then, what do you want for it? Let me think. Oh, yes. Give me a fake beard. Sure, let me just get that from the bank. Is there a bank on this side? There is not. Must go all the way back. And actually, I, don't, I think I do have a fake beard in the bank, so... That locked out. Lucked out on that for sure. Okay, I don't see. Sorry. Oh, there it is. Okay, we're good. We're good. And we go fake a beard. Boom. Easy squeezy lemon peasy. The hardest part is going to be the brewing, the hops, and yeah. I can see that being a big old pain in the boot. Coming up. There he is. Do you have any Kelda seeds? Well, my. What was it again? Oh, yes. A fake beard. Look, I've got it right here. Splendid. Give it to me, please. 
Now, how about those seeds? Well, we've got to kill the hop seed right here. Pass down generation after generation in my family. Wow, really? No, I'm just kidding. Here, you can have the seed. You won't catch me farming some dirt patch anyway. I suppose you would never have a proper job or do some decent hard work, no? What? What was that? Nothing. Pippin Pike, yeah. I'm back to streaming. As always, I've always been streaming. I don't know where you've been. I've been right here. Okay. Get the next seed. Go to the White Wolf Mountain by using the minecarts in the pub. Talk to the Dwarven Engineer. Take the Dwarven Stout off the table and give it to him. Wait, okay. To get the next seed, go to White Wolf Mountain by using the minecarts? No, we can do that. I guess I can. I guess I can get to White Wolf Mountain using the minecarts. So sh we shall. Talk to tickets. Get your tickets. Oh, yes. We would like to go to Ice Mountain. White Wolf Mountain. There we go. There we go. White Wolf Mountain, please. That'll be a hundred gold. And we buy it. Go to track four for the minecarts heading to White Wolf Mountain. No, I want to take the ones in the back. And we're off to the White Wolf Mountain. Oh, this place. And we're gonna talk to Korva, Korva. Korvak, the Dwarven Engineer. Hello there. I'm looking for some Kelda hop seeds. Oh, we've got an expert here. Kelda stout is delicious. It sounds ghastly to me, but I want to brew some to help out a, a friend of mine. Oh. I've got a sheed you might like to borrow. Borrow? How can I borrow a seed? I can hardly give it back once I've grown it. Then wha we've got no deal. What if I offer you a drink? Ah, are you offering? I just thought I'd save myself the trouble of waiting for you to ask me this time. I've never asked you for a drink in my life. No, but it seems just about everyone else has. Well, it's hardly a big deal, is it? We've got a huge supply of dwarven stouts right here. That's not the point. And a dwarven stout against a Kaldahop seed? I'm not sure that's a fair trade. Look. Dwarven Stout, here. Now, do you want it or not? I'm not asking you again. All right, you talked me into it. Hmm, that stout was delicious. Here, have my invaluable Kelda Hop Sheed now. It washed my last one. 
And there we go. We have all of the seeds. Okay, four to kill the seeds, a rake, seed dipper, spade, two buckets of water, two barley malt, pot, obtained for free, 25 coins, and a beer glass. Once you have all four seeds, go to the hops farming plot in front of the palace in West Keldegram and east of the bank. Ask Rend the gardener for advice on planting the seeds. Okie dokie, I will do that. Keldegrim, please. Okay, so now... Is there a water... Yeah, there is. Okay. Gotta fill up these buckets with some water. I need some help. Yes, Lestrade. What can a humble gardener like myself help you with? I have four Kelda seeds here, but I but need some advice on growing them. Marvelous! Those seeds are quite rare, don't you know? First of all, you must remember that these seeds only grow underground. Sunlight is harmful to them for some strange reason. There is a patch in the palace garden that you are more than welcome to use. Thanks. Is there anything else I need to know? Just take care of the weeds in the patch and plant your seeds. They'll grow into hops very quickly. If you're lucky, Kelda seeds have a remarkably fast grow rate. Thank you. Your advice is much appreciated. All right, so we're going to rake a rake a rake out these weeds here. I any minute now, there we go. Get them weeds. There we go. Now we're getting them down. There we go. We got them. They're all gone. All, all the weeds have disappeared. And so now we're going to plant, plant the seeds. Oh, wait, 15 to 20, likely 18 minutes. You don't have to be online, but you'll have, you'll get a notification when the hops are ready saying, perhaps I should take a look and see if my Kelda hops have grown. The hops don't require attention or water and cannot get diseased as they are known for having a remarkably fast growing speed. If you need something to pass the time, talk to Rin the gardener and deliver a letter, letter for him. You must take it to gardener south of Falador. You can quickly reach him by using the cabbage port from the floor ring 2, 3, and 4. Then go back to Caldegram. Ryan will get you two marital seeds. Okay, well, let's do it. Let's deliver the letter for him. This is important to the quest, so 
Not gonna read that out loud. Uh, but we got to go to Felidor. I don't have any Felidor tabs. No, I just need one. One. And need this. Gonna need this. Gonna need this. Boom. All right, Falador. Gotta go this way. Yeah. Okay. South South Falador. Had to had to double check. I had to double check. I have a habit of going to the wrong direction, and I don't want to do that. Why, yes, I am. Have I become that well known? Well, I've got a letter here from your friend in Keldegrim. Ah, oh, you mean Rind? Great to hear from that little fellow again. Can I see it, please? Of course. Most enlightening. Please give him my regards next time you see him. I look forward to the next conference. Okay, guess there's a farming conference. Nice to know. Hey, free air rune. Tell you what, I bet we could. Pest control world. So we can do let's do some uh do some pest control while we wait for this to grow. And yes, I'm gonna keep these things in my inventory because why not? we're not losers here I know exactly what I'm doing okay everybody knows you run over this way you ignore the middle mid to win is not not a thing boom look at that So much damage. Boom, so much damage. Oh, I'm getting hit for so much damage. Oh, a spinner. God, this stupid brawler's in the way. 
Oh, the yellow shield. Oh, it's dead. Good, good. Oh, this stupid brawler. It's gonna get it. It's gonna get it! What? I've never seen this brawler before. Got it. Easy. Come on. When is the stupid blue portal going to fall? Let's go. Hey, I don't got all day. Seriously, the blue one's going to be the last one to fall because it's that big of... I s okay. Of course. There we go. Boom. Use the special attack. Because it's weak. It's weak to magic. And the special attack of the Ceridoman sword is magic. So obviously, why wouldn't you use magic? Boom. Emmy win. can easily do another one and we're off we're gonna just, just gonna keep going over here why change it up I did good over here dead didn't even know what hit him Oh, stupid spinner. Yeah, I get out of here. Oh, come on, spinner. Oh, that yellow shield's gonna go down quick. Come on, let it be blue next. Purple. Man, these are a lot better than people I was playing with yesterday. Come on, don't let the blue one be the last one again. It's no fun. Nobody likes it when the last one is the blue one. Oh, and it is. Wait, why isn't the yellow one fallen yet? Seriously, what, what, what the, f what, what is going on over here? Seriously? This is the easiest one to down. Now we're poisoned. Nice. Okay, get the blue one. Go. Go. Go get the blue one. Boom. We didn't lose. I thought we were going to lose because there was a whole bunch of dumb stuff going on. Okay, crops still have not grown, so we're just gonna... Somebody's mad that he won. Maybe he lost. Maybe they lost their round. Maybe he's not part of this, this elite, this elite team. There we go. 
No, blue shield down next. Blue shield down next. Okay, the other one fell. Good. Purple shield, lame. Be the blue shield next. It's the blue shield. Nothing can stop us. We are the best at pest control while we wait for our Kelda seeds to grow. Come on, Kelda seeds. You can do it. Grow. Oh, this dude. He's. F don't freaking attack me. I have 85 strength, dude. Oh, blue's the first one. Boom! Magic! Oh, we did it. I didn't even know, so I wasn't I wasn't paying attention. I'm a bad I'm being a bad pest control player right now. Oh baloney. The red okay. Oh oh yellow is down, yellow is down. Boom. Heading to purple. I gotta help out the purple pals. Purple pals attack. And we have won once again. No alert on the on the uh, seeds. However, I'm going to assume that the that my little timer here for the pest control is also going to be the same for my seeds, since it's about the same cooldown as how much time it could take for the seeds to pop. Come on. Oh. Out, out of my territory. I don't care. A spinner! Get out of here! Ugh. Come on, yellow. Go down. Don't make me walk over there. Oh, it's just one guy? Oh, shit. There's spinners.
Come on, let's go. Let's do this. Die spinners. Another one. Okay, good. All right. Red, let let's go. The Kelda, the Kelda seeds are ready. We did it. Okay, so let's put put on our questing outfit. Get our teleport. And let's get moving on. Thought I hit travel, I guess I hit talk. Got to harvest, gotta harvest the seeds. Gonna harvest the seeds. The seeds of the Kelda Seeds Okay. Harvest. One Kelda hop. You now need to head to the bar in East Caldegram and upstairs to the fermenting vat. The vat at Port Fazmats will not work. Okie dokie.
Okay, so we'll go upstairs. The value you get a message. These special hops need to be brewed in the Kelvin Brewery. I've already. If you already have the contents in fermenting vat, bring eight beer glasses or two. The contents are still fermenting. You can drain the vat. If you're ready to brew the ale, use two buckets of water on the vat. Then add two barley malt. Then Kelda hops. from the table and uh, if you don't already have one and ask Lane Dare to fill it up with ale yeast. Hello, I wonder if you could help me with this whole brewing thing. I might be able to. What do you need to know? Do you have any spare ale yeast? Well, as a matter of fact, I do. Although I wouldn't describe it as spare, this ale yeast I've got is the best money can buy. But if you've got a pot, I'll fill it up for 25 GP. Very cheap, as it happens. It's a good deal. Thanks, that's all I needed. This will take another 15 to 20, likely 18 minutes, and you will get a notification when it's ready. When it's done fermenting, turn the valve and use a beer glass on the barrel uh, and head to the drunken dwarf's house just north and talk to him about the red axe. He will ask for the Kelda stout and then tell you about the boarded up tunnel along with a small cutscene. Looks like we're doing more pest control. Yes, uh, uh, more pest control. Hold it on. Teleporting. Teleport to the te pest control. I'm still going to keep this stuff in my inventory because I don't see a reason why to take it out. And we will use the Saradom and Sword of Power. And again, we got our own little timer here, which I think should work. 
The best chill CC in RuneScape. Okay. So I'm trying to get that void armor for my range. Got 88 points. I got a long way to go. I got a long way. But uh, yeah, I think I'll, I think I can get there. At least with the intermediate, you get four points per. Could be worse. Why would that guy use a special when the special should be used on the blue shield? Oh god, a spinner. They got it. They got it. Yellow portal going down. Purple portal shield has been downed. Will it die here soon? Hopefully it does. Seriously? Die, stupid thing. Come on, seriously, why is the blue shield like the last one to go down all the time? Like, I don't get it. Come on. It's literally the only one left. There we go. Yes. Use the special attack. Shing. Oh, it did nothing. Oh shit, spinner. Take it down. Oh good, we got it. No, I don't want your stupid sandwiches, sandwich lady. Oh, we're so close. We're so close. Maybe we'll get, maybe we'll get the 3k strength XP. Then I'll get to level 86. It'll be amazing. Yellow shields down. Yellow should die soon. Oh god. Seems like it's struggling. We'll get it. There we go. Oh, there's a stupid spinner. Stupid spinners. Come on, drop the blue. Drop the blue. You know you want to. The blue portal is down. The blue portal is down. Ooh, we only got 2k left. Oh, 
and we won. Come on. Oh. What? What? The gate's not closed. The gate's not closed. Die spinner. Oh, shield is down. Using the special attack. Shing. Ooh, we only have 1800 experience and then we'll get that level, boy. Come on. Come on, Mr. Shields. Why you no die? There we go. There we go. Now we're doing some damage. Just a little bit more, please. Come on. There we go. Okay. Yellow. Let's go to yellow. What? Get this stupid brawler out of my way. Please. Plocks. Plocks, thank you. Thank you. Get out of my way. Trying to get to the shields. Trying to help out. Trying to kill time while I wait for the Kel to brew. To get done fermenting. Trying to get... 1400 more strength XP to get to level 86 strength. Boom. Try to get those. Come on. There we go. Get in the boat. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. The Kelda, the Kelda style is ready. What am, uh. Oh, well. Okay. We'll do this. Is the final one. We'll get that strength. We'll get that strength level up in this one for sure. There's no way we won't. Oh, shoot. The shield is the first one down, like I always want. Oh, and the spell didn't work. Shit. Spinner. Get that spinner out of here. Oh, we're so close. There's a thousand XP. All right, let's go to yellow. Yellow shield down. Let's do some damage. Ooh, 600, 600. Four hundred. Come on, let's get the eighty six on this and then we can get back to the quest. The fermentation is finished. Oh, come on. So close. So close. Oh, come on, fifty. Come on, 50. Boom! 
Boom! Level 86 strength, everybody! That's what I'm talking about. Let's kill these spinners. Boom! Okay. Now that that is finished, let's get back into our questing attire. And we will... Go get... Our nice booze and give it to the drunken dwarf. And we will f continue the forgettable tale. That fermented a lot faster than I thought. I'm actually really glad about that because I didn't uh, want this to take five ever like it already is. But, uh, what? That's okay. Travel. Boom. Okay, let's keep going. We need to go here. We need to go upstairs. and use a beer glass. Boom! We got the delicious and nutritious Kelda Stout. He's up here. He's at the kebabs. He's at the kebabs. I need, I need to know about the red axe. I want to kill the stout. I've got some kill the stout right here. I just brewed it in the laughing miner. No, there's a good human. Give me that! Are you sure? This is pretty bad stuff. You want to hear about the red kebabs? Or what? I mean the red axe. Here you go, then. Oh, that's the good stuff! The red axe. You want to know about them, do you? Then let me tell you my tale. It's long and quite unforgettable. A long time ago, quite a while ago, yes, I resigned from my mining company, the Magenta A- Accordon? Accordon. Uh, I don't know. Accordion? Accordion. Got it. The what? The Magenta Accordion? That's not a mining company. It is, it is! It's one of the many minor companies, not part of the consortium. Alright, if you say so. Right, so I had just left my company. I had enough of slaving away in the mines and decided to become an explorer. Yes, like my cousin. I explored the old mine, you know, just south of Keldegrim. I think it's boarded up now. Some amazing things I saw there. 
First of all, and then I nearly fell into the abyss. So I had to turn and run for my life, but then. Pink Dragons. And I don't really remember anything after that. People think I'm a drunken fool. That was very interesting. I'll ignore that part with the pink dragons, though. But I shall investigate that tunnel immediately, south of the cart station, just south of the carts, to White Wolf Mountain. If you say so, I just want to smash some stuff now. Talk to the cart conductor to the south of the train ticket tracks. Only one of the conductors will give you the option to ask him about the close off tunnel. Now talk to the director of the mining company that you joined during the giant dwarf quest, which is located upstairs in either the west or the east marketplace. I don't remember which one I joined. Oh boy. Actually, I think I joined one close to the, uh, the bank. Tickets! Get your tickets here! That guy doesn't... This conductor, maybe. Yeah, that one. Ask about the closed off tunnels. Excuse me, can you tell me what's behind the boarded up tunnel to the south? Why? Well, that part of the mines hasn't been used in a long time. I don't rightly know what you would find behind there. I need to go there through there. Can you open up the tunnel for me? I don't have the authority to do that kind of thing. Then, who do I need to talk to? I really need to get in. I don't know. Perhaps you have an influential friend? Uh, the giant dwarf quest, which is located upstairs, blah, 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 blah. I gotta think about which one I joined. Uh, I don't remember. Oh yeah, it was Blue Opal for sure. Ah! Welcome back to the Palace of Keldegrim, Lushraid. Maybe I talk to this guy? Ah, hello, Lestrade. Have you seen the statue? It looks beautiful. It's a pity it's been overshadowed by the departure of the Red Axe. Can you help me with a boarded up tunnel? Ah, and what would you be looking behind this particular tunnel? I think it leads to something that might be related to the Red Axe. The Red Axe! This is indeed an important issue. They've gone too far this time. A majority company willing to leave the consortium has never happened before. Can you help me get the boarding removed then? Forthwith, Lestrade! Forthwith! I'll order the removal at once! Thanks, I'll investigate the tunnel immediately. 
Okie dokie. You will find yourself before a gigantic abyss at the end of the cart ride. A short cutscene shows vastness of the area along with the tracks floating out in all directions. You can only proceed through one of the many exits on the other side of the chasm. If you log out anytime during the cave, you will be transported out of the city and your progress will be saved. To do so, you need to complete the cart puzzle. Yay, the cart puzzle! I love cart puzzles. the sky oh. both hands let's go welcome to my cart I am deep underground now, but how do I supposed to get across here? Oh, this music. What's going on? I'm very confused. Hey, what's this? I don't know. It's very confusing. Boop, 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 boop. Find a green stone and a yellow stone in the storage box. You wonder what you could use them use these for. To pass this room, operate the controls and place the yellow stone on the farthest spot to the left of the green stone. shown to the right hop into the cart and search the box okay so we place yellow stone here no there and there okay hop in the cart You search the box and find another stone with a green marking on it. Perhaps it should take the cart back. You think? Okay, so now we do green, yellow, green. Easy squeezy. Whoa! Took that turn kind of, kind of fell. Whoa! Uh, oh, whoa! Off the rails! Whoa! Whoa! There. Okay. Search the box. Get another yellow stone. Take it back to the start. Okay. Now we're getting real crazy. We're gonna do a yellow. A yellow, a green, and a green. And hit that okie dokie button.
In room tube, you eavesdrop. What's the plan? Me dead, human. No, no, not yet. He may still prove useful. My axe on his head would have been more useful. Forget about the human and the statue for now. Our experiments are important. We are nearly ready for the next test. My little fire, Lucas. This time they'll survive, I hope. Our slaves are too weak. It will never work. Yes, things would have been much easier with the statue. It was a great plan, sabotaging the base of the statue and brittling the boat until it crashed into it. And we have gotten away with it too if it wasn't for that pesky human. Pesky human, huh? Well, I think that I've <gasps> enough info now. I'd better explore the rest of these mines. Crawl through the hole at the opposite end from where you entered. Oh, that one. I'm the leader of the Red Axe Brigade. I think I'm special. Also, that one guy totally looking like God of War, please. Looks like another chasm I need to cross. Okay, so we need to do green, yellow, yellow. we need to do yellow yellow green green what the baloney Get this. We go back. Now it's getting real complicated. No, 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 no. Okay, there we go. We do green, green, yellow, green. yellow and that will let us leave this cave in room four you appear in a small archive room with a number of bookcases and crates the ones with visible contents being searchable search for the three crates one contains papers salary and shopping list the other two however have much more interesting you must also search a bookcase before moving on okay so we search this search this amazing search this bookcase so 
Okay, moving forward from the reports room, you arrive in the final chasm. What the guthix is this? Another chasm? And even more tracks? Okay, this one we need to do green, green, yellow, This one needs to be... There we go. Then this should give us a yellow stone. Yep, it did. Good, good, good. Okay, so now we need yellow, 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 green, green, green. And then that should give us some more, one more yellow, one more green. And we ride the cart back. Green, green, yellow, green, yellow, green, yellow, yellow. And now this custom starts with the red arm red axe director will show off his army of chaos dwarves. Oh snap. There's the red axe director again. How did the experiments go? The chest subjects are still alive, Director. They will suffice as soldiers. Excellent! We are improving, Lanil. Return to Asperdra and tell your superiors we've had the partial success. I will tell them, but I'd like to see some of your test subjects first, if I may. Look, here comes the first group. Behold, the power of Zamorak! Chaos Dwarves. <laughs> I must tell Veldaban. Looks like we're finding the spying creatures. No!
Um, what? Where am I? Uh... Holy smokes! Three genies in one day! Thank you! Boom! Okay, so I had the kebab. Okay, so now I have to... Go to Veldaban. Veldabon, I must tell you something incredibly important. What is it, Lestrade? I must tell you about... About... About my incredible craving for a kebab. Mmm, kebabs. A kebab and a beer, that sounds great right now. Uh, are you alright? Don't you have any important information on the Red Axe? Mm, yes, I'll be perfectly all right just after I've had a, my beer and a kebab. Yes, I'll have a beer and a kebab in the Laughing Miner. Yum. Watch out, kebabs. I come for you. Pull the strade. I think you've been bewitched. Okay, I gotta eat it in the, the stupid place. Okay. So be it. I knew it were you, matey. Err, you have some good stuff. Very kind of you, Lestrade. Tell us another tale, Lestrade. Yes, tell us more about your kebabs. <laughs> Kebabs. Right, these kebabs, right? A whole g g group of kebabs came marching in, I tell you, marching in a line. And then I'll tell you, then, uh, then I'll have another drink. Oh, the spell has worked its magic again. No one will believe that drunken fool. Boom!
That's what I'm talking about. Two quest points. 5,000 farming XP, 5,000 cooking XP, two mature dwarven stouts. Level 30 farming! And we can now grow willow trees. Level 46 cooking! We can now cook fried mushrooms. Whew! That was a long quest. They were right about that. Now, with that, and we've been running late. We're running long, man. We're running long. That brings us to the end of the stream. And with that, the outro. If you're watching live today, I want to thank you for watching live. If you're watching the replay on YouTube, I want to thank you for watching there. Be sure to hit that like button and leave a comment down below. Also, check out my RuneScape news series, as well as the other episodes of the Optimal Quest Order series. Tomorrow at 9 p.m. Eastern, we will be doing Garden of Tranquility. It's going to be fun. It's going to be lush. It's going to be amazing. And if you're feeling extra, extra, extra spicy, be sure to check out my Patreon in the link down in the, in the description or the link to donate by Litecoin. And with that, I will see you tomorrow.